I don't even think you can hear me. But just in case, this is for all the bad ones because a lot of them will have, they're just, they're just been eaten. Um, I got here two months ago, so they just haven't been really maintained and I'm now up to the task to do that. So, here we go. Why am I so excited? His mama went quick, moving with his cousin, his cousin committed to excitement. So, I'm, you know, it's harvesting. I got this branch, this side right here. Um, it just is extending so tall. Ooh. And something I'm noticing is it's really dry. It's really dry. There's tons of ants that like to crawl up and down this way. Can't really check them out right now. There used to be a bird's nest in here. Um, but a lot of these branches are like, I think that's apex. A lot of these branches are flaky and dry. So I'm wondering if the person that did prune this didn't prune it right. Um, and I'm just trying to figure out how to get this tree, because it's still producing fruit, back to the best place and to get it lower. So as you can see, most of the fruit is up there and it's getting attacked because and I think those are the best beaches on the tree, honestly. But it's getting attacked because, you know, I don't have the ladder that's high enough to really get up there. Um, I'm really thinking about pruning it all the way down in the nub so that we can start again to, 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 you know, have a good harvest next year. But I have a few questions. Because um, it looks like it was pruned as it's been growing. It looks like it's been growing for a long time. And they pruned it up which sucks but i see that you know there's limbs growing out here way i would probably cut this limb because it's growing towards the inside and i want them to grow towards the outside um and there's still you know new growth down here so i, I feel confident about that but my questions are um would be okay to chop chop big big chops big cuts from the top view because i really don't want it higher than the house um, I don't really want it coming over the fence either and Shadi is coming over the fence on this side So we're just gonna post this picture up. I know a lot of dudes on YouTube are doing this um, Peach farming and I love that because y'all help me with ideas. This is an Alberta peach tree I'm pretty sure and you can help me understand what it is actually if I'm wrong But the majority of the peaches that are growing are on this side um, That's where I see most of the fruits so I'd rather this side be pruned out like crazy because um, it's just thick in there and it needs to be cut. So I'm gonna stop what I'm doing because I picked a few and it's, you know, nice to have them, but the majority of what I got are bad vibes. You know, they're all dusty. They're, they're, they've been eaten through. I've seen stink bugs on here. I've seen ants on it. Ants are everywhere over here everywhere because it's so close to the house I wonder if this is where they're farming stuff hey baby girl thank you thank you okay well it would nice it would be nice to have advice I'd appreciate your advice on what I can do